Hello everyone and welcome back to yet another beautiful day here in Criteria Craft and this episode we're gonna start off by lighting the chimney so I, I finally traveled to the nether got some more nether rack and uh, I've been postponing this because honestly I mean this seems like a good house to have a fire in don't you think no not at all but we're gonna try it because why not I think the whole place is gonna burn down yep definitely think so I don't know though actually because it has a one by one barrier between each block but then again it could could potentially catch on fire there's a good chance um, so yeah I don't know it's risky but I think I'm willing to take the risk so we could uh, we could lose everything in this episode that is that is a possibility so I've been working on the uh, little blacksmithing shop this is turning into a project that's taken quite longer than expected and uh, so I want to try and get it finished today or at least get most of it finished today uh, the really hard part about this whole project uh, was just time really I haven't had a whole lot of time to just get on here and, and play and stuff like that so I've been working on that trying to find this one chicken that's around here I know he's back at that I think he's in one of these houses it seems like every time I pass by he clucks it's hilarious we gotta go find look at all that zombie flesh we're gonna go find some pigs now there's one right here oh they're all over there okay I think I didn't I breed some of these I think I did because I had a bunch of carrots and now I don't have any so I had to have got four there yeah I think I did I hope I did I definitely don't oh yeah we're fine I was gonna say I don't want to run out of pigs but there's plenty walking around uh good gosh this project I need to go let's see I need to go and put two more of those there I can't get up there, so I'm not even going to worry about it right now. Look at that. What were they trying to get in here for? Yeah, I don't know. Well, if you can tell, something is definitely different about uh, the video right now. Uh, it's not in 60 frames per second anymore. Uh, I just was doing a test run with that and just seeing how many people actually used it. Uh, and how many people didn't so let me know in the comments if you want me to bring it back and I will um, Let's see. I need something I can burn <gasps> Burn baby burn I'll just use this fence for now um, So yeah, it is Been forever and a day since I have last made a video need to really chop down all these it's getting in the way I'm gonna steal some of this wood I'm gonna replace it with cobblestone so it should be fine alright let's place that back I actually kinda like that better it looks a little bit more sophisticated but I just needed some wood man for this uh, forge over here because everybody knows forges take wood uh, so yeah uh, it has been forever since I've made a video like I said so I haven't gotten a whole lot done on this world um, I've just been piddle farting around honestly um, just trying to get a little bits and pieces of things done here and there I've been working on alone in the wilderness with contagion just trying to get that all together and uh, things like that so yeah I'm also working on a little project 
Uh, I can't talk too much about it because I want it to be a surprise uh, when it comes out and I want everybody to be able to uh, you know get a good little thrill off of it um, it's pertaining to alone in the wilderness I will say that but um, yeah so contagion uh, is helping me with alone in the wilderness a lot uh, a lot of brainstorming and things like that has gone into uh, alone in the wilderness season three uh, I know it's been long awaited and things like that I've just like I said been super busy and trying to uh, you know make things right and you know instead of doing them twice over just do it once over and, and make it right uh, because it's you know it's just a lot better if you do things right the first time than having to go back and fix it later there's that chicken you bother me so much so much just got dripping lava nothing new just falling down into the water oh good gosh all right let's get on to this been postponing it long enough <laughs> Uh, so I need to put a roof on. I don't know exactly what I want to use though for the roof. Uh, I ended up going with a nether brick uh, floor because, well, it just looks nice and uh, kind of adds it adds a little dark tint to this room, which I like. Which kind of gives it that I wouldn't say medieval look, but it, I don't know. It just looks darker, which is good. Uh, so I'm thinking. I'll actually go with, let's see, I don't know what kind of roof I want to go for, maybe cobblestone, because the base is cobblestone, could do that, just take this top layer off and then do a cobblestone, yeah, I'll do that, alright, so I'm going to work on this roof and I will be back with you guys in just a moment, see you guys in a second. Um, I wasn't expecting gas. Right. This is awkward. Well, it's official. It is safe. It is stable. Nice. Uh, so it is the next day in the Criteria Craft. And we got zombies bouncing in the water with lava dribbling all over them. Uh, so this project, I'm gonna call it done because, well, I mean, it is it is done. It's just, there are still a few more things that need to be done to it, such as this, I need to finish this. But besides that, I mean, can you get any more perfect? It's a toolsmith for crying out loud. I mean, he just knows, he knows what's up. He knows what to do in here, right? Come on, let me hear. That's right. All right, so I'm probably going to wrap up this uh, little project here, and then we're going to move on to something else, right? What do you say? Give you a big old kiss. Right in the... He will be missed. <sighs> he was a great toolsmith. Not gonna lie, even though I know that's stable and safe. Oh, that noise of the crackling fire just makes me cringe because I know my house is so flammable. Um. Let's see. I guess we could try and find a horse. Um, or maybe I should get back to your comments. That's a smart idea. Now, of course, there are going to be times where I don't get to every single build. And uh, some builds take me longer than others and things like that. And I'm going to try and be more efficient with my time, guys. So that way I can get more done. And uh, we can actually move on to different builds and not sit there on one build for forever. So that's what I'm going to start doing. Um, 
it's going to be a lot more time consuming for me, but for you guys in the long run, it will give you guys better videos, and that's what I want to do. I want to focus on you guys more than myself, uh, just because without you guys, well, I don't have much. So, uh, you guys are like my top priority. So, we got this Christmas tree, which is cool. It's just sitting here, though. Um, I don't really know what to build. I got a few things on my mind, like a farm and things like that, uh, that are just, you know, my builds and that I need to get done uh, in order to sustain a good little uh, world here. That was weird. Um, so, like, this little nether hub. I think I was going to call this city hall, but honestly, I don't really need a city hall uh, because everybody knows I'm the sheriff in town and I will kick butt. And, uh, yeah. But I guess a nice thing would be like a little farm area region thing. Um, I'm definitely going to put some type of resort in over there just because this looks so nice. I'm going to get rid of that too. Um, but yeah, I got a lot of things to do and uh, not a whole lot of time. But I do think I'm going to go ahead and wrap up this episode here, guys, because I do want to move on to uh, another recording and things like that. Alone in the Wilderness is coming out very, very soon. Uh, me and Contagion are just trying to uh, wrap up the whole uh, idea of the ending and things like that because it's super crazy. Contagion just literally blew my mind with the idea he came up with and we're just trying to make sure that's the route we want to go with it. Um, I really try to in include Contagion in on Alone in the Wilderness because uh, he came to me and was like, hey, you know, I want you to kind of help me with my role play and things like that. And, uh, yeah. So, I I'm trying to let him just take it and, and do what he needs, or do what he wants to with the series. And, of course, you know, with my approval and things like that. But Contagion's like my best friend, um, you know, when it comes to YouTube. And... I really want him to uh, play a huge part in my channel so yeah so we're just kinda seeing where it goes from there um, of course I'm still playing a huge part in Alone in the Wilderness and there's gonna be a huge 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 ending um, as well as a little something something at the end for you guys uh, which will be exciting, but the night is coming to, and I need to get going. So I will talk to you guys in the next episode. If you did enjoy, don't forget to slap that like button, and I will see you all in the next episode. Have a good day, guys. Don't forget to uh, purchase a, what is it called? Good gosh. <laughs> I'm terrible. I'm terrible. I really should know what my own things are called, but it's actually in the morning time when I'm recording this. So I'm like super tired because I just woke up. But yeah, uh, don't forget to buy a Embrace the Shield t-shirt if you have the money because I am donating a dollar twenty-five of each t-shirt sale directly to a charity called Extra Life, which is a fantastic charity uh, based around helping kids in hospitals. Uh, with the with the needs and everything it's awesome great charity check it out guys if you can and uh even if you can't just spread the word i love you guys i appreciate you so much and i will see you all in the next episode